So, you want to make a muted guitar sound, but how exactly do you do it if you don't have a guitar player? Well, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that right now. Hey, what is up guys? Oh my gosh, it has been so long since I've been on here. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. On this channel, I do original songs, I do reviews, and also videos like this. So if you like what's here, make sure to hit the subscribe button and click the bell notification. All right, so let's get right into it. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a muted guitar sound on MIDI. I'm gonna be using my handy dandy Arteria. Mini Lab here for uh, the demonstration. If you guys have heard my song off it, you probably have heard of this sound. Right? Yeah, that's actually a MIDI. It's not a guitar. <laughs> well, it kind of sounds like it, but that's what this sound is. And I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do it if you guys are looking for this particular sound on guitar. I'm gonna be using GarageBand because that's where I made it. And let's get right into it. Okay, so we're in GarageBand. Uh, let's make a track here. We are gonna be doing, okay, so let me just show you guys real quick the guitar sound that I used for this uh, particular song called Off Hit. So, Sounds familiar, right? So let's say we didn't have this, uh, this, this thing right now. Let's go and make a new track. The first thing that you guys are gonna do is you guys are gonna go into the bass default settings and you guys are gonna pick the muted bass. So it should sound something like, right? That's your foundation right here is this bass right here. And what you guys are gonna do is you guys are gonna be playing an upper octave, or I am playing an upper octave already, but this is lower. And then this is higher. Just one octave higher should, should make the guitar sound. So let's boost this up. Let's boost a little bit of the compression. And no warmth, let's put a little bit of this guy here, the flanger, and you guys are going to be going to just choose uh, the warm. You guys are going to be choosing the warm bass amp per se. So it's already starting to sound kind of like a guitar sound, but what you guys are going to do instead to make it sound more like a guitar sound, you guys are going to Probably, uh, should we cut? No, let's, let's put it like right here. And let's give it just a little bit more mid. And if you guys wanna like put some spice on it, you guys can put on the dynamic microphone and we'll say about right there. Let's say about right there. You guys can boost up the master if you guys want to your guys' liking. Mess around with it however you guys want to make it sound more like a guitar. So now you have your basic muted guitar sound and it sounds... Sounds pretty good guys, I'm not gonna lie. It actually sounds a little bit like a guitar sound. So. That's gonna be it for the video guys. Make sure to subscribe so you guys won't miss out on any of the videos. Make sure to give it a like if you guys are gonna use this particular sound on your song. And also comment below if you guys use a different process on making a muted guitar sound with MIDI. Cause this is what I came up with in GarageBand but you guys may have a different process. Let me hear you guys in the comments below. All right, thank you guys so much for watching and make sure to stay tuned for more videos. I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.